Welcome to the SolarWinds Network Performance Monitor tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll be going over how to configure the Network Performance Monitor to send SMS alerts through PageGate. The first step is to install PageGate. If you haven't already installed PageGate, please pause this video and click on the first link to install PageGate in Windows XP, Server 2000, or Server 2003, and click on the second link to install PageGate on Windows Vista, 7, or Server 2008. The next step is to configure carriers, recipients, and groups in the PageGate admin. If you haven't already configured carriers, recipients, or groups in the PageGate admin, please pause this video and visit the video tutorial section of our website for more information on how to do that. Once you have PageGate installed and configured, you'll need to install and configure the Network Performance Monitor. It should be noted that the Network Performance Monitor requires IIS to be installed so be sure to install IIS before proceeding. After downloading the installation file for Orion Network Performance Monitor, double-click on it to begin the installation. After entering your email address, click on Continue. Decide whether or not you want anonymous data to be sent to SolarWinds, and select your choice. Click on Next on the first step. After carefully reading the End User License Agreement, Select I accept the terms of the license agreement and click on Next. After selecting your preferred installation folder, click on Next. Select whether or not you want to do the Express or Advanced install. In this tutorial, we'll be doing the Express install. Click on Next and then click on Next to begin the installation process. Once the installation completes, click on Finish. After the installation completes, you'll need to configure SolarWinds Network Performance Monitor. For more information on how to do that, please visit the SolarWinds support site. Once you have the Network Performance Monitor configured, the first step in telling Orion how to communicate with PageGate is to configure PageGate's Get ASCII module. To do so, open My Computer or Computer, browse to your local hard drive, browse into the PageGate data folder, Create a new folder and name it Orion. Once you have the Orion folder created, run the PageGate admin. Go to the Interfaces, Get ASCII, Settings, then click on the ellipsis button next to the polling directory. Browse to the C colon backslash PageGate data backslash Orion folder, then select it and click on OK. Put a check in enabled and then click on Apply. Tell it yes that you do want this to be enabled for all existing groups and recipients. Go to the Program Settings section. In the Run on this server section, make sure that Scheduler, Get ASCII, and Connector 1 are checked. In the Run Page Gate As section, move the dot down to Windows Service. Click on Apply. When prompted for credentials, leave them blank and click on Apply again. After the program is finished switching run styles, you should see this icon of a pager appear in your system tray. Left-click on it, then left-click on Start, and finally close the PageGate admin. The next step is to configure a new alert or series of alerts in Orion. To do this, go to your Start menu, and in your Programs list, mouse over SolarWinds Orion, then Alerting, Reporting, and Mapping, and select Basic Alert Manager. When the Basic Alert Manager comes up, click on Configure Alerts. Click on New Alert. Click on the Property to Monitor tab and make your selection. Click on the Alert Trigger tab. From the list of available options, select when the alert should trigger and reset. Click on the Action tab, then left-click on Add Alert Action. Select Dial Paging or SMS Service and click on OK. Click on the ellipsis button next to Page Recipient. All of your PageGate recipients and groups should appear in this list. Select whichever recipients or groups should receive this alert and then move them into the Send Page To column. Click on OK when you're finished. If you want the sender's name on these alerts to be something specific, enter it into the From field. In this example, I'll be using Orion. Go under the Trigger Message tab. There are a variety of things you can enter here, including a list of variables that can be used. 
For more information on what variables can be used, please visit the Orion support site. Go under the Reset Message tab. There are a variety of things you can enter here, including a list of variables that can be used. For more information on what variables can be used, please visit the Orion support site. Click on OK. Now that your new alert is in the list, let's run a test. But before we run the test, run the PageGate monitor. Once the PageGate monitor is running, go back into the Basic Alert Manager and make sure that your new alert is selected. Left-click on Test Alerts. Click on Test Alert Trigger to test the alert trigger and click on Test Alert Reset to test the alert reset. When finished testing your new alert, click on Done. And when finished adding new alerts, click on Done. This concludes the tutorial on how to install and configure SolarWinds Orion to integrate with PageGate. For more tutorials, including how to install the PageGate server and configure the Gdaski module, please visit our website, www.notepage.net.